Hey guys, on today's video I'm going to teach you how to get this custom image on the background of your PS4. So you guys can upload any image that you guys want. So let me just show you in settings first of all where we're going to go later on. So what we're going to do is go into themes and then under themes you guys will see select theme and from there you're going to select custom and from here select image. Yes, I'm going through this really really fast but later on I'll take you step by step. Just want to show you a brief of what we're going to do. So from here we're going to use a USB stick okay and on your USB stick you guys can upload any image you guys want and then just put it here. Just make sure that image is 1920 by 1080 which I'm going to show you that in a second. So right now if you guys have a screenshot from your PlayStation you guys can also choose that. So if I go to system storage and I had anything captured in here, I could choose those images. However, we're gonna do a custom image right from your computer and we're gonna put it right here in your PlayStation and this is where we're gonna get started. So in your computer to get started, just insert that USB stick into your USB port and from there you should see this USB, right? In there, you guys will have to create a folder named images. So for example, I can just right click, new folder, and I'm just gonna name this folder images. Once I do that, I'm gonna have this folder named images and inside this folder is where I'm gonna place all the images I want. So for example, I place this image right here. It's a PNG, I think PNGs look better. We can use other formats, but PNG I think will look the best. So just make sure it's 1080 by 1920. So we're just gonna right click on it, get info. And this is where exactly we're gonna see the dimensions. So we have to make sure that it's 1920 by 1080 and yes, it could be a different size, but it's not going to look good and it might not even work. So just make sure it's that size. Once you're done that, we're just going to unplug it from here, from our Mac or PC, and then plug it into our PlayStation and just select that image. So once we plug in our USB drive into our PlayStation, we're just going to go right into settings. All right, that's all the way up here on the top right hand corner. And from there, we're just going to have to scroll down until you guys see themes. Under themes, we're gonna see select theme, which is our first option. Under first option, we're gonna go right down here. It's almost our last option to the right. We're gonna select custom. From custom, we're just gonna select the very first option where it says select image. Once we click right there, we're gonna see two options. The first one is system storage and then USB storage device. That means a USB stick or even an external hard drive that you guys plugged into your PlayStation. So right now, we can just go right into there and we're gonna see that image that we just transferred into your USB stick. So let's just click right there. And what we're gonna do is just select enter. And it's best that you guys actually see it applied and not the preview, it's not the best preview. So just apply it and then go back, see if it looks good. Maybe you guys want to change it up, maybe change something about it and then keep doing that. You guys can select various images so that way you guys can play around with this. Anyways, I'm just gonna go all the way back so here's my image, it's all good. That's my custom image. If you guys would like to choose any custom image, this is the easiest way to do it. As you guys can see, if you guys have any questions, comments, you guys can write it down here in the comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.